Tesla's 4680 battery will revolutionize electric vehicle batteries with greater energy density, longer life cycles, and increased capacity. However, StoreDot, an Israeli lithium-ion battery company, claims to have regenerated the 4680 battery with a trigger. It can be fully charged in 10 minutes. According to Dr. Doran Meyersdorf, CEO of StoreDot, the 4680 battery with a 10-minute charge time has been in development for three years. Achieving the goal of ultra-fast charging a cylindrical cell in just 10 minutes has been on StoreDot's technology roadmap from day one, said Meyersdorf. After three years of intense development and testing, leveraging our wide range of world-class research areas, I am extremely proud of the fruitful global collaboration that has made this important achievement. Want to know about it in detail? Well, stay tuned till the end. Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we will talk about Tesla's claims new insane battery charge 100% in two min destroy 4680 cells. Meanwhile, subscribe to this channel and press the bell icon. That being done, let's start. It is very important that we are able to provide EV manufacturers with a choice of portable formats using our XFC technology, which will overcome existing barriers to ownership of EV, range, and charging anxiety. Tesla announced its 4680 battery on Battery Day last September, a revolutionary new battery chemistry that will kickstart the automaker to price par with gasoline-powered cars and increase efficiency. Company Batteries Currently, Tesla is building the cells in-house at its Cato Road, Northern California facility, but it is also looking for third-party suppliers to help manufacture the cells as they will be used in vehicles. Tesla's large displacement such as Model Y. StoreDot's 4680 cells look similar, but the big difference is in the charging requirements. According to Keith Ritter of PE Engineer Compliance via Inside EVs, Tesla's 4680 cells are supposed to recharge in 15 minutes but StoreDot cells are capable of charging in 10 minutes. The company said in a press release, StoreDot's ultra-fast charging cylindrical cells use a form factor of 4680, a type of battery that is increasingly popular with global automakers and has been in development for more than three years. Pioneering work on these disruptive technologies has been initiated at the University of Warwick in the UK in conjunction with StoreDot's strategic partner BP. It is developed by mobilizing experts from all over the world, the work is covered by five umbrella design patents and uses StoreDot's continuous tab technology. Such a cell design increases throughput and solves the safety and performance issues commonly associated with the rigid shell construction of cylindrical cells. Testing at StoreDot facility shows promising low levels of internal resistance. Cylindrical cell models are now speeding up the production line at EVE Energy, StoreDot's manufacturing partner in China. StoreDot said it was in talks with major automakers though it did not detail specific brands. An increase of 4680 cells in the market could make the electric vehicle sector more competitive if big companies get access to the batteries, but they won't enter large-scale production until 2024. Each battery pack includes approximately 4,000 individual batteries. These individual batteries, technically cells, are defective, but you cannot replace them. In fact, you cannot replace them. So gradually, not suddenly, more and more of those individual cells die, and the storage capacity of the battery as a whole gets a little worse. But there's really no mechanism by which the battery assembly could fail and need to be replaced. That doesn't happen anymore. Batteries degrade in storage capacity after many miles of running, but batteries have been proven to last 500 to 600,000 miles, and with newer battery technology, they can wear out at a million miles when the car rest is shot anyway. Tesla's latest Model Y uses what's called a structural battery, where the batteries themselves form the entire center of the chassis. With these cars, replacing the battery is essentially impossible. So what are your thoughts on this? Let us know in the comments below. And that's all for the day, guys. If you found this video interesting, make sure to hit the like button. Also, subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon to never miss an update from us. Thank you for watching. We'll see you at the next one. Until then, peace.